tonight from Royal Farms Arena in Baltimore, Maryland. It is the Towson University Tigers taking on the Huskies. Feed it out to Walker, eight on the shot clock. Back over to Ford, takes it into the paint, back out to Walker, fakes the three to Donnelly, wide open for three, and he hits. Yeah, that's ball movement, that's what ball movement does. Eight on the shot clock to Adalamoto, drives, puts up a floater, banks it home, and the Tigers down. Six to two with 17.03 remaining. Donnelly tries to feed it to Miller, who fell down and picked up by Morcel. Mike gonna drive, takes it all the way to the basket and lays it home. And it's six to four. Tigers down two with 16.28 remaining here in the first half. Ford with Eddie Keith covering him. Now Foster comes out, tries to hand Great it off deal. to Walker, stolen away by Morcel. Two on one break. Mike gonna take it himself, lays it up. No, followed by, a dunk by Parker Rivera, slam dunk. And we are tied at six, and Williams takes it to the baseline, feeds it out top to Ford. Ford with an 18-foot jumper, that's good. Quincy Ford with his first bucket, and it's 9-8. That stops the 9-0 Tiger run. Mike to the baseline, backs up, feeds it down low to Adalamoto, through a double team, lays it up off the back of the rim and goes. William Adalamoto with four points, and the Tigers go up by a score of 18 to 17. Bell right side to Adalamoto. To McNeil in the corner. Down low to Adalamoto. Puts up a five footer and scores. William Adalamoto with six points. And the Tigers up by three again. 22 19. 540 to go in the half. Dribbles to his right. Takes it right down the lane wow. and slams it home. 23 22 Northeastern with 425 to go in the half. Feeds it up top to Foster. Left wing to Morsell. Morcell going to back up, fire a three, nothing but the bottom of the net. Mike Morcell with five, and the Tigers go back up 25-23 with 4.03 to go in the half. Passes left side to Marshall for a three, and he hits it. Jimmy Marshall with seven points in this ball game. Tied at 27 with 3.02 to go. Byron going to fire a three-point shot off the front of the rim, no good. Rebound grabbed by the Huskies, and the half comes to an end. So the Tigers will go into halftime, leading by three, 32-29. Bounces right side, gets it over to Walker, covered by Parker Rivera. Tabaj watches Walker fire a three over him, and he hits it. Again. David Walker with his second three, and Northeastern takes the lead, 37-36. Well Adalamoto up top. Well below our average for this game. William going to drive. He scoops it up and scores. Tigers cut it to one, 41-40. William. Starting to take over a little bit here, 14 points. Feeds it baseline right to Davis, to Foster, who drives and lays it up and in. Walter with his first basket of the night. Tigers down, 50 to 44. John with eight on the shot clock, left side to Morcell. Mike gonna fire a three-point shot, short rebound, grabbed by Adalamoto, puts it up, hangs on the rim, won't go, gets it again, and lays it up and in. William with 18 points and seven rebounds, and the Tigers down 52-46. It up top to Foster, left side to Morcell. Morcell gonna launch a three-point shot, and he there. hits it. Mike with eight, and the Tigers down nine. Pulls out, this is a veteran team. William, uh, Walker and Ford, both seniors, along with Stahl, a senior. Williams drives, feeds it to Ford, lays it up and wow. scores. That was a pretty pass. Ford with 16 to lead the Huskies. They're up 10, 60 to 50. Morcell, left side. Gonna fire a three-point shot, and he go. hits it. And a timeout by Pat Scary. That's his last one. Tigers down seven with 218 to go. So the Tigers gonna fall 71 to 60 to this Northeastern team. As their CAA tournament hopes have been dashed here tonight at the Royal Farms Arena by a score of 71 to 60. Uh, obviously a uh, tough loss anytime you, you know, you, you lose a game in a conference tournament, it's a tough loss. Credit to Northeastern, we just, uh, we, we got out of sorts uh, defensively in the second half. We really spent the whole week, uh, which obviously we didn't do a good enough job getting the message across about guarding threes and, um, you know, Walker and Ford, but we, you know, we, just, we just didn't guard well enough, played hard, Guys played hard, they've done that all year, we, but we just, uh, we, we made too many errors defensively. Uh, and, you know, we, we, like I said, it's hard to win a game shooting 61%. And we had, to, we obviously couldn't get to the foul line for whatever reason uh, that was. I have to take William, I think he's gonna have to go to the hospital. He got hit with everything. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. 
first game, he's ne never got a free throw attempt. Uh, but, you know, like I said, we didn't guard well enough to win. This group's been really fun to coach, and that's why I look forward to oh, getting some more. I mean, it's tough right now, but hopefully in a couple, you know, three, four days we can reset. But, you know, um, they, they've, they've responded. They've played hard all year long. They've been, they, they have good chemistry. They've been great to be around. Um, and, you know, I honestly really wanted to, you know, get one tonight. I think the, the, the first one's the most important one. But it's, a, I mean, I love the group. I really do. It's, it's been my, my, my favorite group. And like I said, hopefully we can uh, play some more because so many of them do return.